I see her on the uh, Grammys. All right. I promised you a variety show, and that's what you're going to get. I'd like to introduce our next act, the very talented Jessa Piaia. Let's hear it for Jessa. Anita, 
once. Twinkie Twinkie said, oh, that, that poor, poor girl coming up from such a strict Baptist family. Well, she just didn't know much about life. So he had to spell it out for her. Besides, Clarence doesn't even like Coca-Cola much anyway. Drinks it in the, the, in the cans, not the bottles. How they turn those things around. No job is worth it. No one should have to endure the, the trial that my husband did. I'll never forget that dark, windy night when the telephone rang and a cold, thin boy said that she was willing to step forward and go public. That night, my husband died a thousand deaths, one death for every point of Bush's life. <laughs> When Clarence Thomas was just a little boy growing up in Pinpoint, Georgia, on the farm with all those animals, his granddaddy used to tell him, give out, don't give up. And then during those proceedings, those little, little people tried to turn those same words around to say that Clarence Thomas used to say was to get, to give out, was to get in. So I ask you, what has become of the state of justice in America? Oh, that was an ugly, ugly circus. One that I will not soon forget. As far as Clarence's performance on the bench, man, he hasn't had to make a decision yet. So only history and you will be the judge of that. Thank you.